Welcome, everybody. So what I have here is log base 3 of d plus log base 3 of 3 equals 3, and we want to find our value of d. So whenever we have multiple logarithms, the first thing I always want to look into is using our properties of logarithms to try to condense or simplify the equation. So the properties of logarithm states, when I have the addition, or well, the product rule of logarithm states, if I have the addition of two logarithms with the exact same base, I can condense them down to a single logarithm of the product of those two logarithms. So what I can do is I can rewrite this as log base 3 of the product of d times 3 equals 3. All right, and usually we write, like to write instead of d times 3, we'll write it as 3d. Now, what's so important about this is because now I have my equation written as a single logarithm. So now I can transfer it over to exponential form and see how I can solve the problem. So if I transfer this over to 3 exponential form, I have 3 cubed equals 3d. Well, 3 cubed we know is 27 equals 3d. And now I just need to simply solve for d. So I divide by 3 on both sides by using my division property of equality. And I get d equals the number 9. So again, the main important thing when looking at this, when you have multiple logarithms, especially when you have a sign, you want to see, can I see if I can use my um, properties of logarithms, the product property, the quotient property, or the power power, or the power property. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That's how you solve D. Thanks.